The other thing that you can do in QuickBooks to kind of help secure your information is set a closing date. That's also under company file or company set closing date. What this does for you is once once you have um, given your information to your accountant or prepared your own tax return, you don't want your information in QuickBooks to change. You want it to stay the same as what you filed on your tax return. Or if you've given a bank financial statement, you don't want that information to change. So if you go back in six months and put in the date of the um, financial statements that you gave to the bank, you want all the information to be the same. And one way to make sure that that happens is to set a date. So you can set a closing date. So you would pick, I'm going to pick 1231 of 2010 because I don't want it to interfere with what we're doing today. And you can, you have the choice of adding a password or not adding a password. If you put in the closing date with no password, it'll just pop up and tell you that you're going to change um, data in a closed period and ask you if you're sure you want to do that. If you put in the password, you're, it's going to require you to actually put the password in to do that. Um, one of the passwords that we use at our office is called CPA, just to remind people that they're changing information, and I'm probably going to have to go back in and correct it. So that's one thing that we use for a password. So once you hit OK, it tells you that you don't have a um, password set, and we're going to just keep it that way. I went under Company and Set Closing Date. See it up there? And then set date and password here. Oh, it keeps going there. Where does it go, Kathy? Date and password. To company oh. preferences. Yep, that's where it's going to go. And then you got to set closing, set date and password. Just that part, that part is where I missed. Okay. So everybody needs to have a password in their file because it's going to be important later on something that we do. So if you just want to throw pass or a date in there, password's optional. Hit OK.